Hi guys, welcome back, Stomp here. Today's video is based on drawing, so as you see on the title, how to draw a rose, and we'll be doing it in the Adobe Illustrator Draw app. So uh, let's get started. All right, so let's get into the project area. Uh, we're gonna tap the plus screen, uh, go to image layer, find an image that you want. And this is the image of the rose that we'll be doing today. Uh, you could obviously choose anything that you wish and uh, also don't worry if the image is a bit fuzzy as you can see on the screen uh, you're going to be tracing over it anyway I just size it up and um, I want to move the uh, draw layer to the top with the image layer on the bottom tap the image layer uh, and just set the opacity so that you can just see the image um, underneath uh, but um, if it's a hundred percent it's like too full on so you just want to see the image and um, pick the pencil that you want to use pick the size start drawing now the size doesn't matter uh, you can have it thick or you can have it thin it's totally up to you I just think that starting with a, a smaller size pencil um, works better for me and uh, you can just, you know, uh, arrange it any way you like. So that's pretty much what you, you just got to keep following the outlines. Don't worry if you're not too um, straight or to or maybe you're a bit shaky it doesn't matter if you make a mistake you could always go back and also like as you're going along if you do if you do little mistakes here and there uh, do overlaps for example um, doesn't really matter you could always just finish the outlining and then come back with the eraser tool and uh, just you know touch up the uh, the image and fix up your mistakes and then uh, you can do all that just uh, before you get stuck into the coloring as you see you, you're going to do quite a few swipes back um, during your drawing so yeah just the main thing is just to have fun with it so we're going to do a time lapse now to speed up the um, the outlining and uh, we'll be back shortly. guys we are back and we are into the um, the part that I like the best and it's the colouring so we're going to pick a colour for the actual rose itself and we'll pick the standard red colour and what you do is tap and hold in the section you want and it colours it all by magic and um, continue and all the sections that you wish to color make sure all the outlining is connected to each other just so those areas you want filled in will be colored correctly if you do have coloring problems it's just because that you haven't uh, you know uh, connected the um, outlining correctly so just make sure that you do that just go along and uh, with this image I am going to 
uh, do do some lights and darks as well. So it's uh, just going to make the image uh, a bit more 2 2D or 3D. Just going to make it stand out a bit more. And uh, you can take as much time as you can with this. But because I'm doing this video and I don't want it to be too long, um, I'll just do as much as I can. And while I'm doing that, um, I think we will go into another time lapse and I will see you at the end of this process. Hey guys, we're back um, with a completed image. Um, there you have it, a nice lovely rose. Uh, standard colour with the red and some shading done, the darks and lights. Uh, but you, obviously you guys could uh, keep working on it. Um, but as it is, as it stands now, it looks pretty good. So. If you're happy with the way it's turned out for yourself, um, all you have to do is just save save the image and then you can do whatever you wish with it. Thank you guys so much for uh, watching this video and if you did enjoy, please uh, drop a like on the video. That does help me um, to produce these kinds of tutorials. So um, and that being said, thank you so much. And if you'd like to subscribe, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and uh, have a great day and I will catch you in another episode.